Daisy Duck, Daisy Duck and the Magic Shoes. At the end of the story, three surprise questions await you. Please subscribe, like and share the video. Thanks. One sunny afternoon, Daisy Duck was walking through Duckburg when she spotted a small, shiny box in front of an old shop. Curious, she opened it and found the most beautiful pair of sparkling pink shoes. They shimmered in the sunlight and had tiny golden bows on them. A note inside the box read, For the one who believes in magic. Daisy giggled. Magic shoes? That sounds like fun, she said to herself, slipping them on. As soon as she did, the shoes began to glow, and before she could blink, she was lifted right off the ground. Whoa! Daisy exclaimed as she soared through the sky. She could feel the breeze in her feathers as the shoes carried her high above Duckburg. Looking down, she saw all the familiar places, her house, Donald's boat, and even the park where she often went for picnics with her friends. But then, the shoes gently set her down in a mysterious forest. Daisy had never seen this place before. It was filled with tall, twisted trees and sparkling flowers that seemed to hum with energy. As she wandered deeper into the forest, Daisy met a wise old owl sitting on a branch. Hello, Daisy, the owl said in a kind voice. You found the magic shoes. They bring you here to help the creatures of this forest. Help them? Daisy asked, tilting her head. Yes, the owl replied. The flowers are losing their sparkle because they're missing the light of the sun. Only someone brave and kind, like you, can find the hidden mirror that reflects sunlight back into the forest. Daisy, determined to help, set off on her adventure. She climbed hills, crossed streams, and finally found the magical mirror hidden behind a waterfall. Using the mirror, she reflected the sunlight back into the forest, and the flowers glowed brighter than ever. The creatures of the forest cheered for Daisy. Thank you, Daisy Duck, they said. Daisy smiled. All it took was a little magic and a lot of heart, and with that, the shoes brought Daisy back home, where she knew she would never forget her magical adventure. Questions? What would you do if you found a pair of magical shoes? Why do you think Daisy was chosen to help the creatures in the forest? How would you feel if you went on an adventure like Daisy's? 